What is going on guys? So today I'm going to show you how to add an automatic signature to the end of your emails in Gmail. So like basically you want to send an email out and let's say you want to say uh, doctor blah 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 at the bottom of every email or like say or your company name maybe like Microsoft software engineer and then your name at the bottom of every email. This is how you do it. Uh, but in that case, you wouldn't be using Gmail, but not important. So I'm on my spam email here and we're going to use this to test this out. So let's go to the top right up here on settings, click see all settings, and then make sure you're on general. So general is the tab we want. And then we're going to want to scroll down right here to signature. So this is very close to the bottom. Um, and then we can just click create new. We're going to call this work signature. Click create. And now we can create our signature here. So let me just type uh, a name here. Um, and then let me put us, let's say I want to put my company logo. Um, I'm going to upload an image, select from my device. Let's go pictures. Sure, let's do CS2. All right, I work for CS2. Um, so let's do game developer and obviously you can change like the uh, font underline bold you can modify anything you want here but we'll leave it like this for the sake of this video so this is my work signature um, and then just some rules you have to apply here so for new emails use this work signature that I've created and then on reply slash forwarding emails, use this as well. Um, insert signature before the quoted line in replies and then remove the dash line that preceded it. That's also if you're replying to somebody and then they're using that email as a reply. Um, actually, no, that's if you're replying to somebody, it'll just remove the uh, dash line that preceded it. So usually it, it adds like a dash line and then puts your signature. Let's not check that off just to see what it looks like. And then we're just going to click save changes. And now we're going to do compose. So as you can see, that's the dash line it was talking about. You can remove that, that checkbox. But yeah, that is now my signature every time I'm creating a new email. So even if I reply, let's try replying to Quora Digest. Um, and then I scroll down. There it is right there with the dash line, Andre Tester Game Developer. So that's how you add an automatic signature in Gmail, guys. Hopefully you found this video helpful. If you did, drop a like. Don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.